Welcome back. It's been a while, but Monarch season has officially started here in Michigan. I can judge that based on just, uh, you know, I saw my first Monarch yesterday. May 23rd, just for record-keeping purposes. I was in Port Huron, saw one flutter by, so I know they are here. And so I thought I'd christen the season with a little quick one here just to show you something that's going to be useful in some future videos. And the reason I want to show you this is that I just got a new milkweed sprout. I'll show you what I mean in a second, but first, do you have a toilet paper core? Take the toilet paper core, cut it in half. Doesn't have to be perfect, doesn't have to be perfectly straight. Now in one of these core halves, I'm going to cut north, south, west, and east. I always want to say east and west. North, south, west, and east. And I'm going to cut halfway up, or thereabouts. Cut down here too. Again, does not have to be perfectly aligned, perfectly straight. So now I should have a toilet paper core that is cut in half, and I've got these four incisions in it, more if needed. I'm going to take these pieces now and I'm going to fold them in. And I'm just going to fold on top of each other. There! Now what did we make? Well, we made a place where we can grow a little milkweed sproutling. And, the best part, you already paid for the toilet paper, so this is kind of free. No real cost there. Probably we're just going to dispose of this anyway. And it's biodegradable. Let's get a sprout in here. So I'm going to put just a little covering of dirt down here at the bottom. Just a little bit. Gently take now my milkweed sprout. I'm just going to gently place it in there. It doesn't have to be pointing straight up either. As it continues to grow, it'll straighten out. Cover it up now with some dirt. Looking pretty good. All right, the sprout is in. Cool. Now, I don't know if you use some sort of gardening tray or not, but uh, I'm just going to place it in this container. Got some paper towel here that's just moistened a little bit. Place that right here. Now that it's where I'll be keeping it, I'm going to certainly give it a little bit of water here. Moisten that soil. So there we go. We can now place this someplace in uh, some indirect sunlight and let it take off. And now we just need to sit there and give it nice words of encouragement. Or heavy metal music or something. Pretty cool, right? Now here's the best part. Because it's a toilet paper roll, when the plant gets to the age, gets enough growth to where it's ready to be transplanted into actual soil, into uh, your yard or out in nature, well, you can just pick this up, dig a little hole, and put it right in there it's biodegradable. Something you may have just decided to throw away or recycle anyway. I loves me some uh, repurposing. So I wanted to show you this quick little technique because I'm going to be using that plenty this summer. Or at least I have plans to. You know, with the questions that people ask on the videos for Raising Monarchs, it, it really helps me kind of feel, get a sense for what kind of questions are out there. What kind of information do people feel they don't have just yet. And that has guided a lot of these videos. If I'm seeing a question asked multiple times, well, maybe that needs to be a topic for a video, and a video needs to cover that idea. But I think also, since a lot of people are asking way more questions about monarchs than they have about milkweed, it's kind of shifted the focus. And really, I want to get us back on milkweed. The number one way to help out the monarch is by restoring the habitat. So let's plant some milkweed, and let's talk about some better, some easier, some faster, some more fun ways to do it. That's what you can look forward to this season, but also just be prepared. When it comes to, like, milkweed videos, they take longer to get to where they're ready to be filmed than uh, a caterpillar making it to an adult butterfly. So bear with me. They take time to make. They're going to take some time to edit. But I'm super excited to come along with you on the 2020 Raising Monarch season. And, and let's not forget, in these trying times, you know, a lot of things aren't canceled. Helping out the monarchs and planting the milkweed has not been canceled. So you're going to be seeing me do a lot of this this year. Figured I'd show you what it is now. Hope it can help you. 
and I hope you're just as excited for the season as I am. Let's get busy, let's restore some habitat this year, and I'll see you next time.